Hello everyone and welcome to this tutorial from University of Kent Greenfoot team. This tutorial today will explain how we can make the Canon catch-up game more interesting by replacing the background from just a white or any background to a map and also we we want to, to recognize the land with water so when it's a water it will sink but when when it's land it will splat so uh, I'm just showing you now the original game and how the blob will splat now what we need to do is to put at uh, the background a uh, map so first of all we have to go to import class and use the helper class map in our scenario now I have to go to my word and change the background to use the map class and let's create an object of any place on earth let's say London now I have to say as usual set background then give it the uh, map dot get image now you can see if I compile that the background became Google map which uh, centered at London and if I run and shoot Germany or France or even the water the blob will splat what I need to do is to change this behavior and for that I'll create a new method called is water this method will detect if a specific pixel is on water or on land so is water taking a uh, location which is XY then we'll take the color from the image dot color at XY and if the color get blue more than the color get red and the blue more than the green as well that means this point is blue otherwise it may be green red or gray any other color so you notice that color class is in the AWT so I have to say Java dot AWT dot color I have to import this class now I'm saying image what what is this image the image is actually taken from Google map itself so I have to say the map dot get image I have to to put it in a separate object I'll say greenfoot image image equal to map dot get image and I'll pass the set background as well now it, and it's an object but I cannot use it because it's not on the level of the class in this method so I have to take it outside so I have to say greenfoot image here then initialize it in the constructor now I can compile and everything's fine the world will recognize if it's water or not but I have to change the behavior of the splat of the blob to make use of this so what I have to, to say you notice that in splat it will play a sound it's a plot sound and add this blood object in exactly the blob location and remove the blob so I have to remove the blob always but these two lines will be conditioned so I have to put the condition here if get world get world will give me the abstract world class which doesn't contain is water so I have to cast it to my world so my world get world is water and pass the location of the blob now get x and get y now if it's not water what I have to say add the splat object and play the sound otherwise don't do it and on all cases remove the object compile now if I took the cannon here and run shoot on land it will splat on water it will sync without any sound as well in the next tutorial we will see how we can make use of real weather information in different cities in the world so if I run this game I'll see that this bot is much faster than this one because each one of them is running according to the wind speed in different city so if I run this game tomorrow maybe the blue one will be faster than the brown one I hope that you found this tutorial useful Thank you very much.